going on folks another episode of ryan reviews everything and i am here to talk about the continental from the world of john wick i know i'm a few days late guys been busy but i'm here so uh i like this uh i'm, I'm all in for those who are not familiar with uh, the continental this is actually a a prequel spinoff from the john wick world that we do know and in addition to that this actually tells the story of how Winston Scott became the, the hotel manager of the Continental. All right, so check this out. Due to a number of events, Winston Scott is reunited with his older brother, Frankie, right? And what led up to that is the fact that his older brother, Frankie, stole something very important from the Continental. And we have the, the hotel manager at the time, who was by the name of uh, Cormac, who was played by Mel Gibson, is trying to get, you know, retrieve what was stolen from him. And the excitement all comes into play when the Continental or Carmack uh, ends up sending all types of goons and weird assassins after the two brothers and Yen, who is Frankie's wife. So that's the uh, premise of the story or the storyline or whatnot. And you just meet all types of interesting characters along the way. Uh, in terms of allies, we have Lou, Lemmy, and Miles. They actually are former uh, colleagues of, of Frankie Scott. Frankie Scott, when you see the first episode, clearly makes a lot of enemies. So they're former colleagues of uh, Frankie Scott, but due to some more wild stuff that takes place, they end up being allies uh, when it comes to uh, Winston. So um, I definitely don't wanna to give too much away. Uh, this, this is only a, a three-part miniseries. The first episode was created by Al, excuse me, not Alan, but Albert Hughes uh, of the uh, Hughes Brothers. And uh, if you're not familiar with his work, he was involved with films such as Menace to Society, as well as uh, directing Dead Presidents. So definitely he knows what he's doing and he's clearly been around for quite some time. And I, I'm, a, I'm in, I'm all in for this ride. I'm all in, my, my only uh, setback of course is I'm not the biggest Mel Gibson fan. Um, if you remember the leaked voice message that came out a while back, haven't been a fan ever since then. And I don't even think he apologized for that, but that's a completely different story. Um, but in terms of everybody else, Colin Woodell actually plays um, our Winston Scott in this series. Colin Woodell has been in other projects such as Ambulance and The Flight Attendant from HBO Max. So. He's definitely uh, you know, been in some good stuff. Uh, if you haven't seen the Ambulance or the Flight Attendant series, which is on Max, highly suggest you check out any one of those. Um, oh, and so far, I gotta admit, man, I think my favorite character is Yen. Yen is, once again, um, Frankie's wife, which would make her, you know, um, Winston's uh, sister-in-law. So far, hands down, has to be my, my favorite character so far. The, the thing I enjoy about this series so far is just the, the choreographed fight scenes. It's very intense. Um, definitely, you know, you could definitely see where the, the John Wick, they still keep true to, the, to this whole John Wick style of violence that we've been familiar with over the years. So with that alone, it's just amazing. Once again, the reason why I like uh, Yen is because she, she is with whatever, all right? She ain't backing down from anybody, man, woman, you name it. Yeah, favorite character by far. Um, but, but as I said, um, definitely a good time. Highly suggest anybody check it out. I already got that brief overview, just like a, a really quick recap, cause I know this video is kind of long already. Um, as I said, after they reunite in this first episode, well, actually, I guess I did kind of recap it already. Just go check it out. Uh, it's definitely a good time. Love it or hate it, that's my review. Peace.